Vintage Louis bags have been all the rage and I have noticed a few that I'm seeing over and over and over again. And so I wanted to talk about that in today's video. I'm going to share five vintage Louis Vuitton bags that are extremely popular right now. And if you are someone that absolutely loves Louis Vuitton and you might not have some of these, um, maybe there's a nice little bag in there that you want to add to your collection. Personally, I like all of them. I don't know what it is, but like I've definitely been loving the older Louis Vuitton bags versus the newer ones that are coming out. I love the vintage vibe. I don't know. It's maybe it's just like a um, preference thing, but I think a lot of these are really, really cute. And they've also released some newer versions of these, which I again love these older versions a lot more. So Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. So I got them all written down on my phone. I'm gonna start with the first one, which is the most popular right now. So it's the, do you say crescent? Croissant, I don't know, it's like the half moon bag, right? Um, really, really cute. A lot of influencers have these, especially the influencers that kind of have a focus on sustainability and like, um, recycling things and just being more sustainable when it comes to fashion. I feel like a lot of those girls have this bag. I think it's very cute, very pretty. I love it. Um, I would buy it if I didn't already have one that is kind of taking the place of this in my opinion, which is also on this list and I'll talk about it. But yeah, this is really cute because it's so popular right now. It's definitely a little bit on the pricier side, but if you do some research and do a little bit of hunting, I feel like you can still get it in, at a really good deal compared to getting like a brand new Louis bag. Moving on to number two, which is a denim bag. And little spoiler, there's gonna be two denim bags on here. One of them is on my personal wish list. I'm kind of torn to be honest, but we'll get into that. So the first denim bag is the, uh, maybe maybe you pronounce it Pleaty. I swear I have such a hard time pronouncing some of these names. It's gotta be because I'm foreign, <laughs> because I'm like, how the hell do you say that? Okay, so this one is really cute. Again, it's like a shoulder bag. It has a similar shape to the other one. I mean, slightly different. It has a little flap. Um, it's really cute. I like it a lot. Um, it's not my favorite out of the denim bags that I'm going to be talking about, but it's definitely cute. I think it's a vibe and this one is not that pricey. However, Louis Vuitton has released quite a few denim bags and they have become very, very popular, especially the bum bag and you know, um, a lot of people want it, a lot of people are getting it, but I think that if you buy one of these, you're getting a, a much better deal. So moving on to number three, this is actually a bag that I personally own. I love this bag. Um, I think it is so cute. Now, I got this instead of the first bag that I talked about because I like the shape more. Um, it has two pockets on the front, so it gives a little bit of like, I don't know, utility vibes, I guess. I love that it has a different shape. Um, it's more like longer and a little more structured. And I don't know, it fits my personal style really well. I love it so much. I think it's super, super cute. Also, I will link all of these bags down below, so make sure to check them out. I'll um, go through all the work of finding the best deals as well. Um, actually, I recently saw this bag for like maybe under $900 on Fashion File, so I'll link it down below if it's still available, but I like this. I think it's pretty cute. Um, okay, moving on to one of my favorite bags on this list. It is another denim bag and it's the baggy PM. This is so cute, you guys. It is so cute. I've been searching high and low. Some places have this really overpriced right now and I do believe it's because it's very popular. Um, but I have found some better deals but still not what I wanna spend on a vintage bag. A lot of these are pretty lived in because obviously they're used so people have worn them. So I just wanna be careful with the one that I am gonna buy but this is definitely on my wish list. I absolutely love this. I just am a little torn because I don't know how often I will actually wear a denim bag. I feel like spring and summer, it's perfect, but I don't know how I would feel about it in like the fall and the winter. You guys let me know how you feel about denim. What do you think? Do you think it's like a piece that you can wear all the time? I mean, I feel like denim is sort of neutral, but I'm really weird when it comes to stuff like that. So 
that's the only thing. I'm like, am I gonna wear this a lot? Am I gonna get my wear out of this bag? But I think it's so beautiful. And every time I see someone with this, I just, I think it's absolutely like mwah, chef's kiss. Okay, last but not least is the Hudson PM. Um, this is again a really cool bag. I really like this. I feel like all of these bags have similar vibes, um, but it has some pockets. And I think again, it looks a little bit like utility, a little bit like casual, cool, like, girl next door, but like, I don't know, maybe like a cross between New York City and Paris combined, like, you know, the styles. I think it looks very, very nice. And again, you can get this for a really good deal if you hurry up because we all know once things get so popular and everyone wants them, prices just skyrocket. I mean, it's like, you know, if it's in demand, people are gonna hike up the price. So um, anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up to help me out a little bit with the algorithm. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.